Yeah, good day everyone. Welcome to CryptoGist. In today's video, I'll be doing an ICO review on the course project. So, what is course? Um, course is a crypto one-stop solution. So, the aim of this project is to create um a platform that that takes care of all um intricate parts of cryptocurrencies. So, basically, um, they are this project they are actually they are they are talking sale is actually on at the moment and in this video i'll be going through what the project is all about and to facilitate this i'll be going through their white paper i'll keep a the link to the white paper in the description below so white paper says course crypto one-stop solution made easy Okay, all this boils down to cryptocurrency. They say the inherent value of cryptocurrency as an alternative payment method has gained critical mass among investors, entrepreneurs, and consumers over the last few years. Such popularity would not be made possible without the blockchain technology, which has taken a number of world banks and corporations on a quest to increase the efficiency of their services. The permission of cryptocurrencies and the blockchain technology into the global market is not simply a technological trend or rather a steady shift toward a better future in which managing um, personal finance is becoming easier faster cheap and safe and safer so okay guys we all know that cryptocurrency is here to stay it's not going anywhere and um everyone is getting knowledge about this the cryptocurrency industry has generated an entirely new market or set of technology driven markets which have the potential to disrupt the existing market strategies and the conventional business practices. However, as any other industry, the cryptocurrency industry has to face a number of obstacles which slow down its natural dissemination among the non technical users. One of these challenges is the absence of a one-stop solution that will bring the existing service together into a single user-friendly ecosystem so basically it's having one problem and that problem is the problem of mass adoption and this is the problem that course is trying to eliminate the challenge of uh, mass adoption According to cryptocurrency adoption research carried out by Hadwin, the three main barriers to overcome for greater cryptocurrency adoptions are the easy to use or the lack of user friendliness. Sending and receiving digital money is still cumbersome because each time the user decides to spend cryptocurrency, he or she requires to visit three different websites to be able to do simple operations such as setting up a wallet, making an exchange or spending cryptocurrency. Users are also lacking confidence in the safety of their phone. Fluctuation The price volatility of most existing altcoins is driven by speculation, whereas the lack of liquidity makes keeping funds in cryptocurrency risky for users. The constantly changing cost of cryptocurrency undermines the possibility of them as a value storage governance in the bitcoin system the central the centralized government is viewed as undemocratic implying that the large mining pools and big investors own most of the available bitcoin supply these, these are one, these are some of the uh, challenges cryptocurrency um, is having you know, that was causing the problem of mass adoption in cryptocurrency. So, what is cost? The stands for crypto one stop solution and represents a platform which encompasses all features of a digital economic system based on cryptocurrency. The cost system consists of a gate, a payment gateway like that is POS, an exchange, a, ma a merchant list, market cap ranking, a marketplace, and e wallets various coin 
facilities and the mobile platform. The course platform unifies all transactional aspects that are usually managed by means of faith money and offers multiple cryptocurrency related services in one place. The list of potential features of the platform can be definitely extended and will continue to grow as the platform evolves. That's that is um, a summary of what the course project and platform is all about. So okay guys I'll be let's look at some of the team members. The team course has an international team spread across the world with the managing board based in Singapore and branches in um, New York and um, New York and okay guys I'll be going through their team um down here you can go through their um members of their team we have um Daniel Kreira who is the team leader and the co-founder um these are all of them we have Alexandra we have um we have Luna Lulian the technical Michelle we have this month which is a financial manager so okay guys you can all these guys all these guys all these ones of okay Now before I move forward, I would like to go through their their team. Um, down here you see the list of the several members of their team. I've done some research on them. You could search them through their LinkedIn profiles and Twitter. Um, this is a list of all of them. You can check that um from the white paper. Okay. These are the advisory board members. And also um this project has it has some strategic partners, some good partners. We have the assess, we have um like ones I could recognize here, we have ARC, which is another cryptocurrency, um we have CoinFair, Bridge Law Firm, How the Financial IoT, and so on and so forth. So, um, the mission, the main goal of course is to bring cryptocurrency to the masses. What masses aim? In the mission, the main goal of course is to bring cryptocurrency to the masses. What course aim to cater is its users mission. The main goal of course is to bring cryptocurrency to the masses. What course aims? To cater to its user is a complete experience of assessing the available cryptocurrency services and products in the same place. From the very first moment a customer decides to use cryptocurrency, he or she will be will be guided through the platform and its features, protected from any unwanted negative experience. The user will continuously find the new possibilities to the platform and to interact on it by means of this integrative approach to virtual currency service the platform aims to become the most preferred medium familiarizing the cost um, customers to the cryptocurrencies and the way of using them for this purpose the cost platform is equipped with its own token a wallet and exchange a merchant platform um, Payment gateway or POS and a list of features that are closely related to the use of cryptocurrencies. Okay, vision. The course team is visionary in the way it approaches the development of the crypto one stop solution. On the track to massive cryptocurrency adoption, we do not allow the limiting belief system to interfere with the development of the cost platform. We accept the changes that 
a rapidly evolving technology bring and wake up innovation to any and every level. We plan to success, we plan our, we plan our success with determination and implementing it in our strategy that implies the following step, which is one providing for all the cryptocurrency user needs via a one-stop solution service, rewarding users for bringing new merchants and affiliates on board, establishing a marketplace where cryptocurrency users and merchants can meet each other seamlessly, issuing tokens with real value, expanding network customers to provide the high quality service, enhancing the security of the system and adopt the disruptive enhancing the security of the system, adopting the disruptive innovations. Okay, components of of course. Crypto One Stop Solution is developed with regards to the global needs of the cryptocurrency industry in general and with due attention to the demand of the individual users we intend to manage their assets online the platform is focused on providing individuals with approachable guidelines for a smooth start in the cryptocurrency world helping those who already own a business to improve the quality of their services and catering online payments and cryptocurrency service to individuals. So the initial features embedded in the cost platform designs are the wallet, which provides users um, with a secure medium to store their cryptocurrencies, the market cap listing, the market list as okay, an early version of the cost marketplace on which customers can find merchants accepting cryptocurrency payments for their services directly via cost. Then the merchant platform, which is a marketplace, sorry, on which um, customers can search for merchants, provide for merchants services and products that are cryptocurrency friendly. The cryptocurrency listing is a feature that allows coin developers and owners to add their tokens to the exchange and become part of the cost ecosystem. Then proof of development, a mechanism that analyzes the list blockchain cryptocurrency DApp smart contracts and deal to the developers helping individuals and business to hire approved dev and then a news feed because we have three applications one which is one is going to be the core application which consists of account management tools the registration and login process security procedures and password reset mechanisms then you will have a payment gateway and an exchange where you could trade cryptocurrencies one cryptocurrency to another so this diagram shows what the course project is all about we have the core we have the core application the payment gateway and the exchange I would like to talk about their wallets. So, because funds are kept in three different types of wallets, we have the hot wallet, the warm wallet, and the cold wallet. Uh, the main funds of the cost account holders are kept in cold wallet, while the funds which are expected to be actively used for transactions are kept in warm wallets, thus preventing the loss of funds. The hot wallets are mainly used for deposits and temporary storage. So, we have the hot wallets. Hot wallets are stored in a platform that are used for deposits and warm wallets are stored in a totally separate server that has all the security measures to be protected and a cold wallet a cold wallet are stored in air guard pieces on the course office in Singapore these computers have no internet connections and the transactions from the cold wallet are processed manually by manager, manager the majority of our funds are stored in cold wallets that is good matchat platform matchat platform on course aims to bring together cryptocurrency friendly businesses and potential clients 
facilitating the communication between them for a mutual benefit. In this way, the cost platform performs the role of a middleman in a massive cryptocurrency adoption, helping customers to spend and to acquire their digital coin all in one, all in one place. Then for POS and payment gateway, the payment gateway is an e-commerce merchant service allowing cost users to authorize online payments sent through the platform. This is an effective market tool that supports multiple currencies, integrates the exchange rates and, and speedly KYB process reporting, integrating and payment mechanisms. Okay, this is going to be working like coin payments. It's going to be a means through which you can send payments to um, merchants through the cost platform. Okay, the exchange. So one of the main uh, applications of course is the exchange, which is going to be a platform where you can trade one cryptocurrency, you trade Bitcoin for Ethereum or Ethereum for Ethereum Classic and also to um, convert from feet to cryptocurrency and from cryptocurrency back to feet. So um, the cost platform has an integrated exchange developed to handle both cryptocurrency and feet currencies. The users can trade currencies directly from their cost wallets. Merchants cannot trade on the exchange in order to exchange their funds store in cryptocurrency into feet merchants are required to withdraw these funds to their personal user account which allows them to trade okay see the trading pay on course exchange is are drastically managed from the exchange backend the admin will be able to add a new pair to set up dynamic fees for each individual currency and so on. Okay. Okay, this module shows everything. It shows everything that is encompassed in this thing. So we have the cost pro the cost platform, we have the the core application the payment gateway and the exchange then on the outer um, level we have the history security deposits withdrawal merchant rules user information and wallets so the cost token cost is a hundred percent self funded project that did not rely on an external investment prior to and upon its launch. The new and very expansive curve of its development implies launching a token native to the platform that will provide investment opportunities to people who share the course vision and believe in the project. The name of the token is called so Project. This ICO is unlike other ICOs. Other, other ICOs, they just they will just pro, they will provide a concept, an idea, and um, to ask the public for funds um, to carry out so to implement these ideas. But the good thing about course is that obviously the platform, the exchange was already on before the ICO. Uh, I uh, from one interview. Um, I watched with one of um, the team members. They say they have about a, a couple handful handful of investors in um, in the project. So they already had the funds even before they had the funds had projects before the ICU started. So the reason for the ICU is just to provide a means through which other members of the public um, that believe in the project can have shares in the project. Okay, um, the token swap, like I said, um, the token swap has been on like for a while now. The pre-ICO um, said on July 10th, 
and that ended on July 13th. So right now we are in we are on the main ICU. Um, <coughs> so we started on August 8th, and today is August 26th, and then from the one to five we had several percentages um, until from um, so I think right now we are um, here in the six percent token bonus, and everything is going to end on the twentieth of September, or until the maximum um, token supply is bought up. So the token distribution, um, fifty percent, fifty percent of the tokens we Given to IT development, user experience, um, road map completion. Okay, the ICO fund distribution plan is as follows 50% will be given to the IT development, user experience, and road map completion. 25% mergers and acquisitions, 10% marketing plan, then 10% operations and 5% to shareholders, director board and advisors. Just a quick, quick review of what um, the cost project and cost tokens are about. Thank you for watching. See you in my next video. Bye.